Welcome to Parallel Programming. My name is Viktor Kunchak. And I am Alexander Prokopets. We will be your instructors for this course in the following weeks. Why do we care about parallel programming and how does functional programming relate to it? With the advent of commercial parallel hardware in the recent years, parallel programming is becoming more and more important. Almost every desktop computer, laptop or a handheld device is today equipped with multi-core processors and is capable of executing computations in parallel. It is therefore more important than ever to know how to harness these resources. In this course, you will learn the basics of parallel computing, both from a theoretical and a practical aspect. You will see how many familiar ideas from functional programming map perfectly to the data parallel paradigm. Concretely, you will learn about parallelizing known algorithms such as merge sort or Monte Carlo methods. You will also discover some new algorithms like parallel reduction or parallel prefix sum. This knowledge applies to practical problems, graphics processing, parsing or particle simulation. These are all algorithms that you will implement in Scala using programming primitives from the standard library. Our lectures contrast parallel programming with sequential programming in Scala that you are already familiar with. We explore conditions that make a parallel program compute the same result as its sequential counterpart. In terms of performance, you will learn how to estimate it analytically, as well as how to measure it for your implementations. In each week, lectures will be accompanied by a coding exercise, which corresponds to that week's curriculum. Here, you will transfer the theory into practice by solving a particular problem using parallel programming. After submitting your solutions, they will be graded automatically on our online graders. We look forward to seeing you in our course.